Pizza was 2006 and Don Aldis, the mayor at the time, wanted a festival in Caloundra. He wanted something to put Caloundra on the map. Uh, he wanted something by the beach. He wanted family friendly. He thought it was going to be a country music festival, but it didn't work out that way. It ended up just being a music festival. And I'm pleased about that. We, it means we can present anything. Uh, our only criteria is that it's good and I think we've uh, ticked that box every year. I guess suffice to say, we, we're very diverse in the program that we present. Last year, the festival finished with Xavier Rudd and a great dance performance by the local Cubby Cubby dance troupe. Um, and it was just uh, one of those moments that, you know, your jaw drops and, and you could hear a pin drop when that performance was on. It's good to see so many people come together. They all come in here to enjoy music and to make a friend and to enjoy the beautiful beach and to have the privilege to be to be able to use this space thanks to the traditional owners of the land. George Clinton, Parliament, Funkadelic. I pinch myself when I think that he's played here at Caloundra. John Cleary, the absolute monster gentleman, Earth, Wind and Fire, Arrested Development. The list goes on alongside the big Australian acts, Powderfinger, Jimmy Barnes, Missy Higgins, Xavier Rudd, John Butler Trio. It's been a really diverse, eclectic lineup that we've been able to present alongside all the local artists. It's an important festival for the whole region and especially for emerging artists, for businesses and our accommodation providers. But uh, most importantly, I think it's the community spirit involved in this festival with over 500 volunteers as well. Saturday night, Kalounja Music Festival is a special one for me. And I'm walking around the festival and what I noticed, it was a big festival that has these kind of, you know, really connected and warm spirited community vibes. You know, that often gets compromised when a community festival scales up. So I don't know how, but Kalounja Music Festival managed to, to keep the heart. Caloundra Music Festival has had a massive impact on my business um, from the start, been given an opportunity uh, to, to work here and then which has evolved into great relationships and collaborations through the last eight or nine years and the opportunities that have come from that festival has also created new opportunities which has enabled me to, to grow my business, to employ lots of local people just being on the ground seeing how it assists other contractors like myself and just going into the coffee shop during the festival making more coffees than they ever had bacon and egg burgers whatever's kind of keeping people going so you don't just see it in the festival you see it through accommodation hospitality lots of local businesses around here it's the time. This is probably my favourite part of the Caloundra Music Festival. It's the what it does for local musicians. I know that getting on one of those local stages, so the sand stage or somewhere like that, is a really big deal for locals. And it's how me and my family have got to know lots of local bands. Like, oh, yeah. we didn't know about the dregs no. until Caloundra Music Festival. Well, for me, you don't even have to know who's on the lineup. You just mm -hmm. know you're going to have a great time. I first uh, saw it advertised in the Sunshine Coast Daily that they are starting a, a music festival and that they wanted volunteers, and I thought it would be quite exciting. I could see that it was going to get better and better and better every year, plus making a lot of friends. I enjoyed Powderfinger when they played. It was muddy, but they carried on playing. It was really good. They were really good. Caloundra Music Festival was an, an event that the people of Caloundra in particular thought was long overdue to make sure that the southern end of the Sunshine Coast and Caloundra in particular has an event that it can call its own. This is Caloundra event and they've embraced it and it's really built great community spirit. Yeah. 